Chris Christofferson's health. Chris Christofferson was battling Lyme disease during the last few years of his life. Before the late A Star Is Born actor died at the age of 88 in September 2024, he had been misdiagnosed with another illness. While speaking with Rolling Stone in 2016, Chris and his wife, Lisa Myers, revealed that he was initially diagnosed with Alzheimer's disease. To learn more about Chris's health and how he managed Lyme disease, keep reading. Chris Christofferson's Health During his 2016 interview with Rolling Stone, Chris explained that he was experiencing memory loss. Lisa spoke with Lyme Disease Org shortly thereafter and shared more details about her husband's health. About 12 years ago, he was diagnosed with fibromyalgia, which, looking back, should have been the first indication that a test for Lyme was warranted. Lisa explained to the website in 2016, but we suspect he's been infected with Lyme anywhere from 14 to 30 years because he used to have these chronic muscle spasms, which is a common symptom. Lisa elaborated that the doctors surrounding her and Chris weren't aware of Lyme disease at the time and therefore confused it with Alzheimer's disease. Nashville TN, September 20. Singer slash songwriter Chris Christofferson performs during NSI 50 Year Soft Songs at Ryman Auditorium on September 20, 2017 in Nashville, Tennessee. Photo by Rick Diamond slash Getty Images. Photo by Rick Diamond slash Getty Images. Leading up to his Lyme disease diagnosis, Lisa recalled Chris's fibromyalgia. For a while, he had massive, painful spasms all over his back and legs, adding that watching her husband's pain was so horrible. She also pointed out that the Me and Bobby McGee songwriter's nerve endings were causing golf ball-sized, painful contractions that we battled with acupuncture, heat, and massage. Then finally a spinal cortisone shot by a rheumatologist and a low-dose antidepressant. Lisa also recalled Chris working on the film Disappearances, which required him to be on the forest floor for most of the shoot and being dragged in a makeshift sling for the whole movie. During the aftermath of that film, Chris was diagnosed with moderate to severe sleep apnea, warranting a bi-level CPAP machine, which he tried and refused to use. Lisa continued, he had painful knees and annual knee shots, a pacemaker for arrhythmias, which we now know could be from Lyme. So much Advil for headaches that he got anemic.